Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about Stellar Repair for Outlook. Now, Stellar Repair for Outlook repairs and restores every bit of your Outlook mailbox and saves it in the new PST file, which is ready to import to Outlook. To download and install Stellar Repair for Outlook, which is absolutely safe and get 10% off on the purchase, check the link in my video description. Now, to download the software, what you will have to do is you will have to click on free download and install once it takes you to the uh, website. As soon as the download is complete, you will have to double click on the file and uh, this would start the installation. Now on the first screen, uh, as soon as you double click on the installation file, you would see an option to select the language. You can go ahead and select the desired language from the list of options here. Now I'm going to select English and then click on OK. The next screen is End Users License Agreement. You may click on I Accept and click on Next. So this will um, allow you to select the uh, destination for the installation. So I'm going to keep it uh, default. That is C program files Stellar Repair for Outlook. So in case if you want to install this software on a different drive, you can click on Browse and select a different drive. So I'm going to select C drive and click on Next. So now here it will give you an option to select the Start Menu folder. I'm going to keep it as is. Click on Next. And I'm going to uh, keep the option uh, by default as create a desktop shortcut and click on next and then click on install. Now as soon as the installation is complete, um, when you launch Stellar Repair for Outlook for the first time, you may get user access control prompt. You may click on yes or continue. Click on finish. Now this will launch the Stellar Repair for Outlook on your computer. Now once the installation is complete, it is a pretty simple steps what you need to follow. Now you will have to select the corrupt PST file, the file in the format which you want to save. So as soon as the installation is complete, you would get an option which say select Outlook data file for repair. So if you have a PST file saved on the computer, these are the options you would get. In case if you don't get this option, there is a manual way to go ahead and select the Outlook data file. So all you have to do is you will have to click on select Outlook data file at the top left corner of uh, the Stellar Repair for Outlook. Again, it will take you back to the same window. Um, so you can select the default location of the PST file or you can choose the location. In case if the PST file doesn't show up in this list on this window, you can select choose location. And you have an option to browse the PST file and click on find. So if you click on find, it will give you a prompt uh, where if you have multiple drives connected on the computer, it will uh, display right in this section. You can select the drive and click on find. So for the demonstration purpose, I'm going to browse to the location where my PST file is. So I'm going to click on browse. And um, this is where my corrupt PST file is. So so let me go ahead and try to open Outlook and uh, show you wh uh, what data we are trying to restore here. So when I'm trying to open Outlook, um, uh, you see that I have my PST file, which is right in this section, which I'm able to access. Um, if you look at the bottom left corner, um, there is a PST file which has been corrupted. Now I will have to go ahead and um, I will have to go ahead and restore this PST file because this PST file seems to be corrupted. So uh, let's go ahead and try to restore this PST file or repair this PST file using Stellar Repair for Outlook. So let me go ahead and close Outlook. And I'm going to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this PST file because it is recommended to close the PST file when you're trying to run the repair. Otherwise, the repair would not run successfully. And I'm going to close Outlook as well. So in the Stellar Repair for Outlook, let me browse to the location where my PST file is. Let me go ahead and delete this. So I'm going to click on Open and click on Repair. As soon as you click on Repair, it will... Um, give you a preview of the data which is being repaired from your Outlook data file. So these are the email items which uh, which you are able to see from the uh, corrupted PST file. In case if you have any of the um, email items or any of the emails which are which has been deleted, those items will be highlighted in uh, red in color. So let me show you an example how it displays. If you look at the screen, uh, I have some of the emails which are uh, red in color, which means that these were these are the emails which I had deleted earlier uh, while I was while I was opening this data file in the Outlook. So here it helps you to preview all the items which includes inbox, email, 
your task, your contacts, your calendar item. So if you go to navigate between this folder, um, you it will display all the calendar items what you have in the corrupt PSD file. Uh, the, the contacts, in case if you have any contacts, it will be displayed here. The notes and uh, you also have journals and task uh, which I had mentioned. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and save this PSD file into my computer and then we are going to import this data into Outlook. So, so you can either save the complete PSD file and uh, you can either save the individual items from the uh, corrupt, repaired or restored PSD file. So to save the individual item, all you have to do is you will have to select the item in case if you want to save a particular email. So all you have to do is you'll have to do a right click on the preview section of that particular email click on save as message and uh, click on save as browse to the location and save that particular uh, individual email. So this is how you can uh, save the individual item. So for the demonstration, I'm going to save the complete PSD file. So I'm going to click on save repaired file. And I'm going to click on PSD because that's, uh, I'm going to import this data into my Outlook. I'm going to browse to the location and I'm going to save this file in desktop under the recovered uh, PSD file folder. Click on OK. Click on OK again. And this will go ahead and save the repaired PSD file onto the desktop. Now, as soon as the repair is complete, to open this particular uh, repaired data file into Outlook, what you will have to do is you will have to open Outlook. As soon as you open Outlook, you can use the import export wizard. If you want to import the recovered data file into same PSD file, you can use import export wizard. Otherwise, you can open the Outlook data file by clicking on file, click, clicking on open and export, clicking uh, by clicking on open Outlook data file and uh, navigate to the desktop navigate to the desktop under recovered you will find outlook data file repaired.psd because that's the data which is we have repaired uh, repaired and if you click on ok it will show you uh, display the name it says stella repair for outlook under this section you will see top of outlook data file and here you have all the emails which has been repaired and uh, restored from your corrupted data file so this is how you can go ahead and uh, restore your data from the corrupted PST file using Stella Repair for Outlook, which includes the calendar items, which includes the contacts, which includes uh, the notes uh, which I had in my corrupted PSD file. So these were the notes which I had. So like I said, this is how you can go ahead and restore your uh, corrupted PSD file using Stella Repair for Outlook. Now let's talk about why Stella Repair for Outlook is the most advanced tool for Outlook repair. It repairs severely corrupted PST of all sizes and recovers deleted Outlook items. It recovers all mailbox items which includes emails, attachment, task, calendar, notes. And uh, it also saves the recovered PST in several file formats uh, such as P .msg, HTML, EML, RTF, PDF, DBX, and MBOX. And it also offers detailed preview of all the recoverable items before saving. In the technical edition or the technical edition license, it also allows you to uh, split and compact the large size PST. And it also allows you to directly export the recovered PST to Office 365. And that, and that is available in the uh, Technician Edition. And these are some of the top use cases uh, where the Stella Repair for Outlook seems to be a, one of the best tool. So it can recover lost mailbox data. It can repair PST when scanPST.exe fails. Now scanPST.exe is the um, inbuilt inbox repair tool which has been um, provided by Microsoft. So in case if the scan PST.exe fails, you can run Stella Repair for Outlook and uh, repair your Outlook data file. It also resolves Outlook data file error. Now these are some of the awesome features of Stellar Outlook Repair. It repairs large PST file. The PST repair software can easily repair large PST files and restores all the mailbox contents in the original form. It offers detailed preview. The Outlook Repair Utility provides preview of recovered PST items before saving the item. You can check individual items such as emails, attachment, etc. It recovers 
deleted mailbox item it's user friendly process compact split large psd saves mailbox data at location of your choice recovers mailbox data in multiple file formats exports directly to outlook account and office 365 to download and install Stellar Repair for Outlook, which is absolutely safe and get 10% off on the purchase, check the link in my video description. Now, these are the uh, best options. Uh, what is available in Stellar Repair for Outlook? You have a professional edition, technician edition, toolkit. Um, if you purchase the software using the link, which has been uh, given in my video description, you would get 10% off. I hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day